The important thing is that your teammates have to know you're pulling for them, and you really want them to be successful. Once you know what failure feels like, determination chases success. The most important thing is to try and inspire people so that they can be great in whatever they want to do. The beauty in being blessed with talent is rising above doubters to create a beautiful moment. If you don't believe in yourself, no one will do it for you. The moment you give up is the moment you let someone else win. Dedication sees dreams come true. Either way, I refuse to change what I am. A lion has to eat. Run with me or run from me. Being passive-aggressive in this competition means you're fine with simply going with the flow and unwilling to disturb the calm waters of the game to accomplish your goals. This is the moment I accept the most challenging times will always be behind me and in front of me. Trust me, setting things up right from the beginning will avoid a ton of tears and heartache. I have self-doubt. I have insecurity. I have fear of failure. I have nights when I show up at the arena and I'm like, my back hurts, my feet hurt, my knees hurt. I home have it. I just want to chill. We all have self-doubt. You don't deny it, but you also don't capitulate to it. You embrace it. The odd thing is that I wound up learning more about the world around me by having a singular focus inside of me. Determination silences doubters. We can always kind of be average and do what's normal. I'm not in this to do what's normal. Losers visualize the penalties of failure. Winners visualize the rewards of success. Passion is the fuel for success. Everything negative, pressure, challenges is an opportunity for me to rise. Be willing to sacrifice anything, but compromise nothing in your quest to be your best. If you are going to be a leader, you're not going to please everybody. You got to hold people accountable even if you have that moment of being uncomfortable. We all have self-doubt. You don't deny it, but you also don't capitulate to it. You embrace it. The biggest dreams aren't fueled by belief. They're fueled by doubt. We don't quit. We don't cower. We don't run. We endure and conquer. I don't think a coach becomes the right coach until he wins a championship. Great things come from hard work and perseverance. No excuses. Everyone looks at your watch and it represents who you are, your values and your personal style. Everything negative, pressure, challenges is all an opportunity for me to rise. If you're afraid to fail, then you're probably going to fail. From the beginning, I wanted to be the best. I had a constant craving, a yearning to improve and be the best. I never needed any external forces to motivate me. People just don't understand how obsessed I am with winning. I'm here. I'm not going anywhere, no matter what the injury, unless it's completely debilitating. I'm going to be the same player I've always been. I'll figure it out. I'll make some tweaks, some changes, 
but I'm still coming. After all, greatness is not for everybody. If you do not believe in yourself, no one will do it for you. May you always remember to enjoy the road, especially when it's a hard one. There's certain players that I've made cry. If I can make you cry by being sarcastic, then I really don't want to play with you in the playoffs. A lot of people say they want to be great, but they're not willing to make the sacrifices necessary to achieve greatness.